Paris, thanks. Looks like you got some snowplow friends behind you. Get home safe. Our team coverage now continues here in Springfield. That's where we find Western Mass News reporter Olivia Hickey. Olivia, now here down in the valley, what you got going on? Well, Matt, no snowball fights or no snowmen here tonight. The snow has turned into rain and is expected to continue overnight. But whether it be rain or snow, it still creates slippery conditions for drivers. AAA Northeast spokesperson Mark Shieldrop tells people to avoid the roads for safety. If temperatures fall overnight after rain, that's when we start to see ice and other slick spots. And that can be difficult to spot while you're driving. And you don't want to be uh, traveling and then hit a patch of ice. And, and that's when we start to see uh, issues with people slipping and that sort of thing. And let the road crews, if they have to be out there plowing and treating the roads, uh, it gives them an open space to work and, and get those roads treated so that way it's safe for people when they, when they do venture out. Now, if you have to be on the road, Shield Drop says it's important to be prepared with an emergency kit that can include things like a snow scraper, a blanket, and extra phone chargers. As of right now, there are dozens of active closings on westernmassnews.com. They include Amherst Pelham Elementary School, Amherst Pelham Regional Secondary, Greenfield Center School, Greenfield Schools, Pioneer Valley Regional School District, and North Adams Public Schools. Now for the latest on closings, delays, and parking bans. Stick with us on air, online, and on the Western Mass News app. But for now, reporting in Springfield for Western Mass News, I'm Olivia Hickey.